Question 43. Two satellites A and B have the same kinetic energy. Which of the statement is false? The two satellites are both orbiting around the Earth. Hence, we can discuss them in the context of circular motion. This will allow us to equate the expression, mv square over r, to the centrifugal force, g small m big m over r square, experienced by the satellites due to gravitational pull. We then can show that mv square is equal to g small m big m over r. Remember that the kinetic energy is half mv square, we can then substitute the above result and make it become g small m big m over 2r. By expressing in this way, we can see that if the kinetic energies of the two satellites are the same, the one with larger mass, small m, must have a larger r. Hence, b is correct. Next, we know that the potential energy is minus g small m big m over r. Since a higher velocity means that the satellite has smaller mass, this will result in a less negative potential energy or in other word the potential energy will increase. Thus, the total energy will also increases and d is correct. Next, we will see the relation between angular velocity and radius under the same velocity. Recall that velocity is the product of the radius and angular velocity, a larger angular velocity is associated with smaller radius and hence c is correct. Lastly, we come to examine the relation between mass and period. We can make use of the velocity expression in the previous part because the angular velocity is able to be expressed as 2 pi over the period, t. Next, since the kinetic energies are the same, greater mass means smaller velocity, and this further means that the period t is longer. Thus, b is also correct. In conclusion, all of the statements a, b, c, d are correct, and so the answer is e.